what is happening here is the New York Times here presenting you with some HeroCraft Season 2. I can't believe how perfectly that that went into the video, dude. My recording thing was up right in time after I said that. All right. Anyway, uh, we were making fun of a YouTuber, so uh, anyway. Um, we're, we're back here, completing the Obsidian Shop. Uh, the Obsidian Shop? No, please, God. We're not making an obsidian shot. <laughs> um, we do. We did finish it. Basically, what happened is in the last episode, obsidian we tried shot. to make this obsidian generator, right? And it, it worked, but it was super slow to, to do it all and set it up. So we came right here. We tried to make a different old-fashioned obsidian generator, which also worked until I fell into lava and burnt myself up and lost all my stuff, and I raged and quit recording. And so you guys, uh, you guys, I didn't even mean to quit recording uh, when I did, and uh, I just hit the hit the quit record button, and it, it was just that was kind of it. And uh, I guess I must have hit the I must have quit recording because I I don't know I must have thought I wasn't recording because I thought when I died I hit the record button to start recording so. That was okay, I guess I quit recording, but uh, either way, I, I was pretty mad, so Matt got a little obsidian out of that, then we got some more obsidian, and we, we finished this finally, and so uh, what it looks like basically now is the base of a beacon, and now the design we're going to do for this is going to be pretty crazy, I'm going to get, I think all the sand is cooked, we're, this is still the same day as when we did that, we haven't even moved since that recording, we've just been One, here. two, three, yeah, the sand's four. still cooking, so it's going to be a little while. But that's okay, we have other stuff to work on uh, while that gets gets cooking. Um, I can't remember, is quartz four? Yeah, Yeah, it's four. It's four, it's not, uh, not nine. Okay, so uh, while that's cooking, I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of this thing. Looking. So well, I'll show you cooking. what it's going to look like. Which one's a slow touch? Okay, and then... Yep. Uh, luckily, I had a another efficiency five on breaking through pickaxe that I was saving to give to Jessica for her to rebuild the hub. Um, that uh, yeah, I am gonna use as mine now, <laughs> so I'll be working on another pickaxe here. So uh, our plan one, a man pan. What is this quartz one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, that can't be right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hmm. No. Hmm. Let me think. All right. Uh, I'm not sure. Hmm. Let me go. Let me go check some of that. We'll be right back. Do I have my? Pick? All right, guys. We're back. Fluffy and fuzzy. We're spying on our shop just now. Screen, Go yes. away. Um, we went to uh, over to uh, our creative world on a different server to uh, to look at the uh, design for for this uh, beacon. Uh, what we were trying to debate is whether we should do it two away from the glass or one away from the glass, and unfortunately, we decided one away from the glass. Why is this unfortunate? Because the calculations adjusted for it to be two away from the glass. So while I build this. Matt, you may want. Are you gonna go yeah, for the quartz first? I need. I need your. Uh, so touch. Yeah. Okay, Matt's gonna go. F here's here it is. Go for the packed ice and, and the. You have your fortune too. Yeah. Okay, Matt's gonna go get all that stuff while I finish. Uh, this, and it'll take us. Well, a Fluffy's bit. doing something with her golem. Is she? Is she killing him? Getting some yeah. iron? I don't know. She's doing something. I'm actually going to get packed ice and stuff while I finish this, because we'll now we'll need more, so thing one wants to say... No, she's bringing it over. I will kill him. Mm -mm. Don't do it. Dude. That's not nice, dude. What did we... What do we do with the lava buckets? Dang it, where are the lava buckets when I need them? Did yeah, I think you jumped in the lava with them. Oh, did I die with the lava buckets? Yeah, you did. Well, how much of this do we need? I'm gonna kill our iron golem. I don't care. Uh, that 
would be nice, would it? I'm coming, dude. <laughs> okay, I won't kill it. It's okay, guys. I'm not gonna kill our golem. Um, I'm not completely sure. I don't remember <laughs> the freaking design I was trying to do with this. So, uh, oh, all right. I'm gonna look one more time at my stinking creative world, and I'll be back. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, Fluffy looks like she's still snooping around. Um, not, not terribly sure what we're doing, just because the changing of dimensions kind of messed things up for my plans a little bit. But it's okay. We're I'm compensating and I'm changing stuff because of it. It's all good. Uh, I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do for the first face of it, and then I'll probably probably cut the rest. Matt's off getting. Uh, packed ice cord. Packed ice, yeah. Packed ice right now. Oh, you already got. Yeah, you got the quartz. Because while I was looking at that thing, he he finished getting the quartz, I suppose. Yep. Okay. All right. Then I'll put that there, there. So we're just going for a beacon shape here. It should it should look pretty cool in the end, hopefully. Um, but uh, we've I've done some IG ideas ideas <laughs> in a creative world and uh, we'll see how it turns out in the end and uh, let's just keep going with it so today I guess we'll hopefully if this doesn't take too much longer to build uh, we'll build the actual shop and then we'll set up the rules and everything like that oh did I did I just mess it up really no I didn't so it's, it's all good people shut up I know y'all being like you're an idiot because it's you're just stupid well I agree so <laughs> No arguments here. It's been it's been a rough Minecraft day for me, guys. Oh man. Okay, if I died from that, I would've been mad. It's been a rough Minecraft day, guys. It, it just <sighs> lots of lots of stuff. Lots of Minecraft stuff. And so uh, I got got to tell you guys something now. Now tomorrow I had an orgo exam, an organic chemistry exam, right? I'm at pharmacy school, so take off science class, right? And uh, Unfortunately, uh, it's pretty sad. Over Christmas break, we did have a student who got in a, a car wreck uh, after a night over Christmas break in St. Louis. I guess she was she wasn't from St. Louis, so I don't know if she was just here because she lives here now. I know she's from uh, Ohio, I think. Um, I can't remember. Yeah, I think she was from Ohio, maybe Indiana, but... Uh, but she was here for whatever reason during Christmas break, and uh, she did get in a, a car accident. Uh, she spun off in a semi hit her, and she she died uh, over Christmas break, and that was really sad. And uh, I didn't really know her, but it, it's sad when uh, someone our age dies just because uh, you know we're we're pretty young, so it's it's weird to think about somebody. Uh, she was maybe she was in the class above me, so she was a year older, but still, it's it's weird to think that. Uh, People my age are, are dying and so like that. And uh, so Saturday at 1 a.m. Uh, in St. Louis, St. Louis is like home to the second biggest Mardi Gras celebration. And so for some people, some people not being me, Mardi Gras is a big deal here. Um, the thing is, I've been to the real Mardi Gras uh, in New Orleans on mission trips to do uh, street preaching uh, in, uh, in Van evangelistic uh, trips and stuff like that and uh, it's nothing special it's a bunch of drunk people throwing beads at you and it hurts <laughs> it's just it's kind of more painful than anything and uh, it's not a lot of fun to be honest and uh, but in st. Louis is a big deal and uh, there's parts of New Orleans where Mardi Gras is more about the family aspect and the tradition behind it but then there's people who for them all it is 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 an excuse to get drunk. In St. Louis, everyone who celebrates Mardi Gras is an excuse to get drunk. Uh, but I guess they were having a pre-Mardi Gras party, and this guy belonged to a fraternity. I don't, I don't know if he actually belonged to the the frat or what, or if he was just at the frat party, uh, and they were drinking and stuff. But the drinking has nothing to do with it. Uh, they were at a party, and uh, on the street, a uh, guy drove by. Uh, I think they said he is a middle-aged. Uh, he looked late twenties, early thirties. Uh, African American dude drove by. Uh, he was living in 
the kid was living in South South St. Louis, which is a pretty rough part of St. Louis. It's not East St. Louis, but its crime rate is pretty high. But this guy, I drove by, and he didn't really shoot at the kid. He was just shooting off randomly, wildly into the street. And uh, as he drove by, he was shooting, and uh, one of the bullets hit the student, uh, and it killed him. And it struck other houses, and 30 of the... They were all stool cop students. Thirty of them were outside drinking and, and partying, whatever, having a good time, and just chilling out. And then uh, this guy drove by and just let off some bullets and and killed one person. And the one person was from my class, so it's pretty sad. And uh, again, in this case, fortunately, I, I didn't know him, but still, it's unfortunate and it's it's hard to think about that that uh, people uh, my age are are dying and stuff like that. But uh, he did uh, die. Uh, he got shot, and then some of the cla my classmates carried him in after he got shot, and then he, he died on the scene. So, But all that is to say, uh, we had an ORCO exam tomorrow, uh, Monday, and uh, they canceled it because they said, I don't know, the, the teacher said, like, due to all that happening, they were canceling the class. Or not the class. Yeah, well, I guess... The class is completely off. I don't know if the class is off or not, honestly. They just said the exam was off, so I'm, I'm not sure. Basically because either some people are too grieved to study, or some... Because lots of people did know him, and uh, lots of people uh, knew him, and a lot of people were at the party, either outside and actually watched it happen, or were just around, so... Uh, the exam is canceled, but part of me wonders if people emailed the teacher and used this as an excuse to get out of the exam... And to me, that'd be a real shame. And also, part of me thinks that... Oh, you didn't leave enough space there. Part of me thinks that people may have emailed the dean and said, you know, there shouldn't be an exam right now because this is a bad time. So that that's really, really bad if people are doing that and stuff. So uh, so there, there's that story that's depressing. On that note, uh, me and Matt are going to finish up the walls to this, and uh, we will be back when we are done. All right, guys, we're back. We have built all the walls, we have built the roof, and we have put the glass around it. So it's looking like a beacon. That's going to be going. We're going to close that off in a second. But uh, what we got going on here is I have a hole in here for some the water to come through. And then I go up top. Hey. hey. Joe, it's the, the night crew is coming on, guys. Night uh, crew. The people, the internationals and things like that. And right here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a, a beam of water come from above. And uh, I'm not going to I'm not gonna do that off camera because I know it's going to be funny. I know I'm going to die. Matt brought me four buckets of water and a ton of dirt from our stash. Because that's where we ha have all the super secret stuff. And uh, while I finished the glass wall, uh, Matt got some of that stuff for me. And then he came up and helped me complete the glass wall. Um, so... I think I'm good, but I gotta go super high, so I'm gonna use be using like all this. I should have used sand, dude, so that I could just torch it and break it mm. like that. That's what I should have done. That's true. Oh yeah, that's true. I'm gonna go. I have to go really high so that nobody can see the glass. So Matt, I need you to stand on the roof there, and uh, well, I'm getting food right now. <laughs> okay. Whenever you can, come stand on the roof and like crank up your render distance. Oh, crap. All right. You feel me? What do we? What do? What am I doing that for again? Come over to the to where I am, the roof of the place, and crank up your render distance so you can see at what point you can't see me anymore. <laughs> I think I don't think I can go high enough because I can still see the ground. So, and where am I at? I'm at one eighty nine. At what point does water start to freeze? Okay, Matt's gone, guys. Hang on, let me let me go let me go check this out real quick. I'll call him call him back. Okay, I'm gonna just keep doing this. Hopefully, I don't like die at some point here. Okay, hang on. Waiting for his call. Where's that? Where you at, Matt? 
says he's calling, but I don't see. It. Oh, there we go. You there, bro? Yeah. All right. Come over. Are you over on the roof yet? No. Oh my gosh. I'm coming now. I need your moral support. Uh, let's see. One, two. So I need to go. One. Okay. This would be. I think I'm high enough, guys. I'm pretty sure. I, I mean, if I gotta go lower, then that's just tough noogies. No, you know what? Let's go a little higher. Jeez, bro. You see how high up I am? Are you recording right now? Yeah, why? Oh, hi. <laughs> you see how high I am? Can you see me even? Let me get on the roof. I'm gonna right. make some bread at least. I can see the wyvern, so that's about it, though. Oh, I can see the beacon for a flash second. Just a what, little bit. What render distance are you on? But my render distance is at like 3, dude, so... Turn yours up to like 10 and see if you can see me. Look straight yeah. up from the hole, yeah. Shoot, I can see you right now. Can you? I'm on 6 right now. Alright, let me go up higher then. I don't know at which point I can't build anymore. I'm thinking that... Okay, I'm going to build when I can't see the wyvern anymore at all. Okay, alright. I'm on 32 right now. Okay, all right, here we go. Uh, the dirt tower starts two blocks away from the hole, right? Right? One, two, yeah. Okay, so let's go with me, What do you want me to turn it on now? What do you mean? What render distance? I don't know, just turn it up to like 10. I still see you. <laughs> I told Fluffy there would be something at the top of the, her thing, and uh, she made the unfortunate choice of believing me. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I knew she would, too. <laughs> Guys, that uh, just goes to show you, women be gullible. So, uh, Shout out. <laughs> Shout out to women. Over. I'm just kidding. Women aren't aren't any more gullible than men. Um, I'm Have four. you heard that song by Beyonce? No. It's not even by Beyonce, I think. But it's like, who run the world, girls? No? Nope. Never heard that one? Nope. <laughs> Dang it. I just sound stupid. You think, it's a, you think it's a true song? The girls run uh, the world? I mean, I don't want to get into that. <laughs> so I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> Everybody, if you're upset about the comment I made about women, uh, Matt's channel is youtube.com slash users slash IMC Matt. Uh, he's all about women, so you guys can go check him out. Yeah. I was, actually, I don't think I need about this. The woman. Right here. So I think I can just do that. That. If you... I can see the dirt. No, wait. I, I need to do that. Crap. Guys, I'm having a hard time. I'm nervous that this isn't going to work. All right, so just relax. Everybody. All right, there we go. Put glass, glass. We'll tell Joe to come watch this amazingness if she's bored. Has any dirt falling down there yet? Okay, some should be coming down now. Yeah. Okay. Um, I know that I need. I shouldn't have done it like that. Dang it. What'd you do? Oh, crap. I should have done it the other way so that I could uh, pop off. So I'm going to put this here and here, and this here and here. Luckily I brought lots of uh, glass, guys, because it would be in doo-doo right now if I didn't. So what for that, right there, bro? I'm setting up a thing where water can, but I think at this height that water will freeze. I'm not sure. I can't remember. If, I don't know if that's still how it works or not. So uh, let's see. That no, right nah, dude, I, I ain't about that life. We were always about that life. I know, but I'm getting old, right? Never. Yep. Forever. I'm forever getting old. I'm forever 21. Don't make sense. What the heck, <laughs> bro? You gotta hear this. What is it? This commercial on right now is called My Spy Birdhouse. Huh? My Spy Birdhouse. My Spy Birdhouse? Would they spy That's on people with their birdhouses? No. 
It's like it's a birdhouse, but it has like suction cups. The birdhouse for like creepers? No. Not like Minecraft a... creepers, like real no. life creepers. No. no. Okay, all right, I need you to, to stay no, there and tell me. Right quick. <laughs> okay. So it's the birdhouse that has like such suction cups, you know? Uh huh. So you put it on glass on, on your like house, like on a window, right? Yeah. The suction cups, you put it against the wall. Mm hmm. And it's a birdhouse. And then birds come in it, and you can like spy in the birdhouse from the window. That's pretty crazy, dude. It's pretty stupid. <laughs> All right, see if the water comes down. Let me know if it, if it works right. It's taking a while, bro. Yeah, it's going to. I think there was an easier way to do this. When I did this in my creative world, I think I did it a lot smarter. But I didn't want to switch and go back to my creative world again, so I didn't uh, didn't try. It'll take a while. Tell me if it goes perfectly in the hole or not, because that's kind of what I'm looking for. Dang it. What? I fell in the hole. Dang that. that killed me. Is it there yet? It'll fall perfectly in there. Okay, alright, then I'm coming down. It got in there. Did it? Who just said what the crap? <laughs> to what? Somebody just said, what the crap? You see that? Yeah. They talking to us or what? No idea. <laughs> okay, so that should be the last touch on the beacon shop, guys. I think there's going to be some other stuff. Uh, we got to make the downstairs, and then we got to make the rules and the policies and the prices and all that, and then we'll, we'll be open for business. Did it go in the hole, Matt? Yeah, it went straight in. Sweet. That's how you gotta do it, guys. You gotta go straight in the hole. You know? Can't go left or right. No. Nope. Up or down. Nope. Gets messy. Mm -hmm. so, gotta be careful. <laughs> what? The water will just go everywhere, dude. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> what do you think? Get your mind out of the gutters, man. <laughs> Jeez. My gosh. <laughs> you took that so out of context. <laughs> I took it out of context. You took it out of context. What are you talking about? I'm talking about how it will be messy. What are you talking it about? It will be messy. The water will destroy everything, dude. It will be bad. You just took it too far. You took it too far. Your mom <laughs> you takes it too to far every it. night, dude. What? Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> you talking about you go water boy and be like, you talking about my mama? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm pretty sure that this is a, a super they, awesome. They're trying to shoot us, bro. Why are they trying to do that? I'll kick them from the server, dude. It's the girls. <laughs> All right, the girls let's go take a look at this. Hey, what the heck? I'm not. Dude, I'm kicking from the server if they do that again. <sighs> okay, guys, I will be back when I am back to the beacon. How is that possible? Oh my gosh. Wait. <laughs> okay, okay guys, uh I just started recording again. Uh Fuzzy slapped me and she ran away, and so I, I walked up and killed her. Because she has this thing where she seems to think it's funny to walk up and slap a person and run. She almost slapped me into lava and she's killed me frequently lately, so I went ahead and, and killed her. And uh she she hit me and then she ran under her shop and ran away. And I thought you guys would like to see that. And I'll take that on the end of an episode. And uh, that's pretty much it. See you. Okay. All right. I'm back. Hopefully Fluffy and Fuzzy are done being stupid. I kicked her. But I, kicking means nothing on vanilla Minecraft. So she's back. Um, <laughs> <laughs> they took it a little too seriously, too. They got. They thought they were in trouble. Uh, here's what it looks like. Unfortunately, water doesn't load correctly for me lately. Water's been really... Dude. It looks good for me. It looks you Okay. Don't Some worry. of it will just, like, not load for me. It looks pretty cool. Even now it does. So, uh, I, I like it. Oh, I'm so mad that they kill... I've died too much today from freaking lag and things like that. And I, you... It could... It didn't even look like they were really killing me. It was like I was there and then all of a sudden I was dead. So, there's nothing I could do about it. I can even move, so... Alright. There's that. I don't know. Should we work on the inside and stuff today or should we... Should we wait to do that later? I say we do it today. Alright. 
So, me and Matt will think up a plan real quick. I want to open this thing. For the inside, and then we will we'll get to it. So, we'll be back when we've thought about that. Alright, guys. We are back. Uh, we saw the beacon. I was mad at Fluffy and Fuzzy. I think I'm over it now. Kind of. Still been ranting about it. Anyway. Uh, we are not going to do the path to it right now. We'll probably do that off camera just because it'll be boring. If you yeah. don't know what it looks like, it'll look like that. <laughs> okay, boring that's exactly what stuff. it looks like. And it's just going to come in, and then you're going to go under the beacon, and there's going to be a room down here. And uh, this will be the actual door. So let's just do this like that, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven on each side. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And so go to seven that way. All right, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. One, two. And then go fourteen forward. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. All right, and then I'm just gonna go dig over to Matt, and hopefully he'll be there. If not, somebody did something wrong, and I bet it was me. Matthew's and Silk touched us. Oh, dude, you messed <laughs> so okay. Who, who messed up? All right. Yeah, you were probably counting out one, one and three, messed me four, up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, three, nine, four, five, ten, six. eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Yeah, you messed up. You went one too far. Okay, so right, that's cool. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make this five high and uh, fourteen by fourteen, and it's gonna be the actual room where you read up on stuff. And you get a cup of coffee and things like that. And upstairs is where you'll actually place your order. It'll be pretty cool. You'll see. And uh, we'll be right back when we're done clearing this. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, right now we have, uh, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 13, 14, 15. What? I told you. Mine was right, right. No, we went... How's this possible? No, okay. One of the walls is, is longer than the other. Okay, this side is longer, so... We, we may have to fill this in right here, but... uh, This is basically what we're going for. Alright, um, I got some stone. We've basically you done... Let me go ahead and do that. Uh, the question is, do we want it to be 6x6? Six six? Or, uh, I mean, 14x14? 14 14? We definitely don't want it to be more than... See, there's no point in doing it, because... Uh, here, just put a line. Here, watch out. Yeah, there you go. And so, right now, now we have a 14 by 14 room. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to have a 14 by 14 or 12 by 12, but I think 14 by 14 looks good. So if it's 14 by 14, we're going to replace the walls and the ceiling with something else. If it's 12 by 12, we'll just put up new walls, and then we'll replace the ceiling. Well, actually, I dug out the ceiling already, so this will be ceiling, this this layer right here. Uh, so that will be ceiling. And uh, But we're going to save that for, for next time because we're tired. we got class tomorrow, and uh, we need to get off. And uh, so next time, we will finish the interior designing. Uh, I will finish off probably the carving of this uh, later on before we record. And uh, maybe I'll probably finish the, the path off camera and... Uh, then, uh, yeah, yep. we'll be done after that. Today has been a, a weird episode, including, if you include the building of this, uh, collecting of materials and the building. From dying in obsidian generators and, uh, That's losing a lot of weird stuff. stuff. And, uh, coming down and basically falling, like, digging down on dirt, and the next second I was being killed by Fluffy and having to kick her, and then I didn't actually seriously kick her, but, okay, it's just been bad, and it's time to quit. <laughs> uh, it's that time of day so if you enjoyed uh, me being mad and all that please leave a like and uh, if you like our design please say so and uh, give us some suggestions if we if you think we could tweak anything I'm pretty happy with it though I think it looks pretty cool so yeah, I I'm pretty, pretty set on this and uh, the way it will work guys is eventually we'll have this whole hole carved out and you'll go down and when you actually come in down there, you'll actually go up the water to come up here and place your order. But all the instructions and everything will be down there. So 
See, the path is going to come right in under the beacon. And then you'll just swim right up. I wonder where, where it is. Let's see if I can find it. There. Nope. 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 There it is. There's the water. And at some point, we'll break that glass. But we'll, we'll wait till we're uh, further, <laughs> further along for that. And uh, we'll probably collect all the materials for this uh, interior design off camera. And when we come back next episode, in a few days, we will be finishing the beacon shop and opening it for sure. We'll see you next time. Bye.